hello and welcome back to another exciting episode of ARK Survival Evolved on the Ragnarok Hadia server, Alexis Arcade's Patreon server. Uh, this is... <laughs> when, you, when we left off the last episode, I had just tamed the trike and the uh, Tranodon. And as you can see, there's been some slight improvements since then. Um, what happened was, I accidentally deleted <laughs> episode 2, and uh, actually the start of episode 3. So, we're jumping ahead a little. Uh, let's see. I started a little garden up here, which is out of fertilizer, or, well out of poop, because I... No! Well, actually, the first thing you might notice is that I've cranked my graphics up, which, uh, <laughs> after watching the the uh, video today, I was like, nope, nobody wants to watch that. The graphics suck. Let me get all this fertilizer out real quick. And I decided, you know, I just... You know, I'm going to get lag anyway, so it might as well look good, aside from that. So... I'm, I'm going to continue to lag too much, but it's going to look better. Now, one thing that uh, I'm, I, I kind of feel bad making you miss this, but in the last episode, I accidentally ate, when I was doing this, transferring the, I had uh, actual feces. Oh, tell me that's save. Oh, good. Uh, and I accidentally hit E instead of T, which instead of transfer is eat. And I ate shit and died. Which was really funny, sort of. <laughs> kind of sucked, but, uh, yeah. Man, I'll tell you what, turning this up, everything looks prettier. The dino skins. Uh, you know, I have, I, have sky turned down so it's pretty basic uh, ground I'm not sure about I mean this game can look a lot more amazing but uh, you know there are limits to what I can the amount of lag I can handle but uh yeah for uh, it's kind of dark right now hopefully it's I gotta gam it up a little um, Let's see, you don't have any... I need to get some stem berries. Oh, it looks like we got an egg. You lay any eggs? No, because you're a boy. How about you? You're a girl. Alright, let me go throw this up top. Since I don't have a fridge yet, we're putting eggs in the feeder. It uh, doubles the lifespan. Oh yeah, it tamed Argy. It was a level 100. Nothing too fancy, but it is good for starting out. Okay, I'm going to take Mr. Trike out, and, uh, yeah, I haven't seen any comments yet with name suggestions, so they're all going to stay named Starter until I get some. Oh, that's, got Dillos over here. Oh yeah, I made the fancy spyglass. Level 20 female. Don't want it. Uh, 
Yeah, I'm going to harvest all this up and I'll bring you right back as soon as I kill this dillo. You're dead. So I will bring you back once I am ready to feed the Fiomia. And we're back with shit NATO. Uh, if I'm sure everybody's seen what a Fiomi does, but for any people who have not seen it yet, they are amazing. Uh, they're the perfect garden companion. What you do is you get stem berries and you force feed them stem berries and they do something amazing. Yes, that's right. <laughs> they shit like crazy. And then you pick it up. <laughs> I always love when I come down here to pick them up and it makes the, the gulp sound because uh, I'm drinking water that's got shit floating in it. Alright, that was enough for one. So, I'm going to pump some more shit and fill up all those, those other three uh, fertilizer bins and then I'll be right back. Okay, we're back, and all the uh, crop plots are full. I mean, not not crop plots. All the uh, uh, what are they called? Compost bins are full, and it's daylight, and everything's looking so pretty. Uh, this is my first time on here with really good-looking graphics too. Um. I think we should probably take a fly around on the old RG and see what, ouch, see how things are looking. Oh, we got some levelage. Why are you carrying rock? Let's see, I want, give me some of your cooked meat. Yeah, you can, uh, you can feed, you can feed cooked, I mean, a carnivore will eat cooked meat, it will not heal them, if, I mean, you can heal them with raw meat, which does not work with cooked meat, but it does feed them. And it doesn't spoil as fast, so that's always useful. I think I'm going to go with... Oh, man. I would love to get the melee up to 300, but psh, that's never going to happen. Oh, maybe it will. Well, I'm going to put the other two in stamina. I'm going to land and regain stamina. The stamina on this thing is terrible, and it takes so long to refill. But, since we're slow, we need to be able to stay flying for longer. And that's what stamina is good for. So, uh, last last time, uh, actually, I don't... Well, first of all, Here's, here's my really generic uh, taming cage for Argies. Basically, I get on my Tyranodon and get Argy to chase me, and then I fly in here, and the Tyranodon can go out the other end, but the Argy cannot, and he gets stuck, and then I run around and close the door, 
and he's stuck in here, and then I knock him out. Uh, that is unlocked and available for anyone else to use. That's a pretty common thing on a community server like this. There is a uh, community taming pin up this way that I actually, I think, yeah, I think I knocked out that Fiomia in there. It's just nice to have a place where you can knock something out and it won't get eaten by anything else. Fiomi is pretty easy to <laughs> knock out on its own, but it was a 140, so I didn't want to sit there and wait for it. Oh, we also got a Dodicarus, which uh, I found it on the other side of this hill, and I built a pen around it and then knocked it out. There's a kitty. What level are you, kitty? 90. And 145. I think we need a kitty. Come here, kitty. He's attacking me. That's all right. I'm gonna drop him in here. Whoops, missed. I don't know who built this cage and put a lip on the top. That just seems really uh, counterproductive, if you ask me. Okay, let's see. This. Have a couple. Of Hopefully, nothing's attacking me down here. Uh, the kitty stayed up there. Good. Should be going down pretty soon with this high of a damage on this thing. If I can hit it, I think I hit it on the tail. There we go. Now we just got to get some food. And Prime would be nice. Let's see, who can we get Prime from? Bronto? Not sure this thing can kill a Bront. Maybe it's a low level enough. Ooh, 25, not bad. 135. Well, if they weren't right next to each other, maybe. Let's see if I can pull her out. Go get away from your friend. Now we can kill you. a lot of stuff. Well, 
I think 11 will be enough, but will it happen in 8 minutes? That's a real question. Throw a little regular meat on there. What are your stats looking like? Uh, not too bad for health. Uh, they'll go up once it tames out. Alright. I am going to think about killing something else. What did we get? One point? Some more melee. I know there's some stegos over here usually. They're, they'd be an easy kill if I get a low enough level one. Maybe I can lure one off the cliff. Wow. There's usually a bunch right here. Something must have cleaned them out. Oh, there they all are down there. Another level already? Sweet. Gimme it. Gimme it. Two ninety nine, nice. Okay. Of course they're all right next to each other. We'll have to pull one out. Let's take a seat here and oh, there's a horse down there. See what we got here. Ninety. Oh, it's behind him. Twenty five, that'd be nice. Well, one fifty Yankee. Eighty five. Fifteen. Okay, either one of those two would be good. Of course, they're surrounded by Brontos right now, which is not good. What are our Brontos? The spyglass is so weird. 50. 25. Two prime. Where did the other one go? Uh, he didn't seem to care. Uh, no point in rushing back. Those other ones still had seven minutes on them. There are a bunch of stegos up here. Man, everything looks so much better now. Uh, 
Uh, my view distance is turned down a little though, so that's why you may see something in the distance that looks like it's floating, but it's just because what it's standing on hasn't resed in yet. What the hell is that? It's like a micro raptor or something. Don't want to go down there. They will knock me off of my bird. There is a number of dinos in the game now that can knock you off of your mount, which is super annoying. The Microraptor is one, the Thylacolio, the, um, wait, is that a taming cage? Looks like it's, it is, but it's made out of wood. Don't try to catch a Carno in there, he can walk right between the pillars. Um, let's see, Microraptor, Thylacolio, Caprosuchus, which is a crocodile. And I know there's got to be another one. Can't think of what it is. Well, let's head back and see how the kitty's doing. There's a Rex. What level are you, Mr. Rex? Level 90. Stay over here, don't go over by my taming pen. Uh, he's kind of headed this way. have to kick his ass if he comes over here. Oh well. I think he's gonna... Well, let's see the timer on this stuff. Ooh, 50 seconds. Yeah, we better put it on. got to be careful dragging that meat over because if you dragged it over on top of the meat with the, the lower timer it would change your new meat to the lower timer. That's why I took it out and put it on mine first and then put it back in. Okay. Looks like he's taking on the 135 Bronto. might just get some more prime after all. If I can sneak in there and steal it before either one of them dies. Might even get the kill, that'd be awesome. Thirty-eight of forty-six. Forty-four of seventy-three. I think the Rex is probably gonna win. Yeah, the Rex got this one. I'll wait till it gets down around 500 and then I'll swoop in there and steal the kill. Maybe. Oh, what the hell, the Rex turned away. I went after a turtle. Don't come up by my taming cage, dummy. Okay, he's already tamed out.
Couldn't even tell I was in trouble, could you? Didn't even run over to this side of the cage. Okay, let's see. Let's see if I can pick him up without losing him on those lip. Amazing. Wow, he is all black. Very nice. Be nice to have a little carnivore action around the base. Aside from the birds. Check those stats. 2200 health, 740 stamina, 288 melee, 328 weight. Not bad, not bad. I'm gonna pump melee to about five up. Not terrible. Oh, yeah, here's my Dodic. Very orange, very awesome. Got some levels too, don't you? Actually, I don't want to sit on you when I get you levels. Four. Let's put them in weight. Because you will roll me over underground. Not that, that matters. Yeah, now when I take the dodic out to get stones, I can have the uh, Sabertooth follow me. In case there's something dangerous around. But I don't think I need it right now. Yeah, the nice thing about the Dodic, uh, it didn't used to be this way, but they added the functionality in later. But as you can see, 475 stones weighs 59.4. But if I move it into my inventory, all of a sudden it weighs 237. So it cuts the weight by down to like 25% of what it used to be. I'm going to give you one in melee. those who don't know, the dodic only gets stone from whatever it hits. I mean, if it hits something that can give it something. Like the uh, the metal rocks, if you hit those with a dodic, you just get stone. He also doesn't harvest any berries, which makes me wonder how they survive in the wild. Don't mess with me, Ichthyornis. Think about this is so much better than coming out with a hatchet and doing this. I built that whole compound without a doe dick. Can't hit that one. It is just so much easier with a dodo. Oh, actually, he doesn't get stoned from everything. If he hits a tree, he gets thatch. I mean, mostly thatch, a little bit of wood. Oh, and I didn't even show you the best part. He has a alternate movement because he's kind of slow like this. So we can get him to roll. And he goes 
you know, slightly faster. Problem is you can't steer when he's doing that. But if he rolls into like a trike, it will aggro. It actually does damage when he hits you when he's rolling. Okay, I need... Actually, I should have got more thatch while I was out. I know... Wait, what is that? Oh, I thought there was a fish swimming in here. That'd be cool. Yeah, I need 400 thatch. So I need to get some more of that. But I am going to pull all that stone in here. From the dodec. Actually, I'll grab that wood too. Okay, let's see what a saber saddle needs. Uh, 290 hide, 155 fiber, 20 ingot. I think I was cooking a bunch of metal recently. fiber and hide. I know the bird's got some hide on him. A saber saddle. Oh yeah, also in the previous episode I made a long neck rifle, upgraded it to 228% damage, and made a few darts. And we what did we use the darts on? Um Oh on the Dodic, yeah. Because the Dodic I shot him with arrows and he went down to I mean, his health dropped really low. And when their health drops low, they curl up into a ball. And then they take less damage and less torpor and everything. And you basically can't knock them out. So you gotta wait till he heals up, try again. And each time with arrows, he just would ball up again. Seriously, we're stuck. Okay, you need to move, buddy. Sit right there. Hopefully your tail's not in the way. Jeez. I need to run free. Okay, let's get your melee up to 300. And then we'll start putting a little into, uh... Um, uh, stamina, probably. Oh, perfect, a peg. Give me back my birthday suit pants, bastard. Oh wait, did he get it in his inventory? Look at that. all these animations for when you level them up and the nice thing if you have if you can get it to do another animation 
then it will cancel it. And in the case of sabers, raptors, things that can jump, you can just jump and it'll stop the animation. Because the animation really sucks, especially if you level up during combat. Like you want to add a little, uh, a little extra melee while you're fighting. Um, when that happens, you can't, you can't fight. You're just sitting there animating, and it's a pain in the ass. Oh yeah, somebody's moved along a lot farther than me. They have a teleporter. Is that a 150? 130? How level are you, Bronto? 50. You know, we probably could take him down. Uh, how much health do we get? 118. That's pretty lame. Six eighty health. Well, if they were not so close together, I might attempt it. Also, I don't really like being so close to the water because if they knock me into the water, I'm kind of screwed. All right, let's take a run down the beach, see what we can find. Trying 15, you're dead. Okay, there's the lag. point. I'm going to put it in stamina. I like to get my sabers up to a thousand stamina. Oh, I discovered uh, <laughs> the uh, the doe dick. If you level him up while he's swimming, he won't do the animation. That's kind of useful. Looks like somebody else has a starter hut. Jiraxel. You know, I wonder. There's a cliff over here. Ah, somebody must have tore it down. There's usually a uh, a log going across here. And you can actually walk across it. I wonder if this thing shows other people. I didn't say who it is. There's another starter hut down there. Hey, you know, it's kind of funny. It looks just like my first starter hut. Two by two square. Well, this is a cool little area. But I don't want to jump down there and not be able to get back out. You know, I could probably run and jump across that. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> That is quite a, that would be quite a jump. Now let's see. 
I could probably jump out there and land in the water. Yeah, now I know I definitely wouldn't have made that jump. <laughs> Is that a dodo egg? We'll take it. The cooling rains have arrived. Man, I'll tell you what. Does this show me how long? Oh, yeah. Jeez, it's been almost an hour already. Well, you know, as much as I enjoy having over one hour videos, I think I'm going to have to call it today. Actually, one more thing I will show you before I go. Let me get over to the obelisk. Uh, if you saw my Millennium Falcon video, uh, my base on Timmy Carbine's Patreon server, you may have seen some of my animals from over there. Well, when Timmy starts a new server, he doesn't let you bring anything with you. But... Wait. I thought she had downloads turned on. Hmm. Well, then maybe not. Um. Yeah, well, I uploaded a bunch of them, and I thought I would... I mean, actually, it's not that big a deal, because I was planning on not bringing any over here. But she used to have uh, downloads enabled. But I guess she doesn't anymore. And that's cool. I think her other Arcadia server had it. Well, let's get back to the old base. Alright, well, we got a nice... 145 saber tooth tamed up. Up to 222 already. Nope, 223. And uh, once again, thanks for joining us. Uh, as always, don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoy the new clearer picture with possibly less lag. I don't know. I'm looking around here. It's hard to tell. It looks like there might be a little bit of a delay there. Um, hopefully, I mean, <laughs> it's got to be better than what it was in the last episode, right? Uh, so hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. And as always, feel free to share the video with your friends. And leave a comment. We still need to name a bunch of uh, various animals that are all named Starter, including our new Sabertooth. I am Croat and Emote myself out of here. Bye-bye.